Hello and welcome to a quick pre-test review sort of thing. Um, I've just tried out the Fanatec CSR Elite Formula Rim on Codemasters F1 2012 on the Xbox um, 360. <laughs> uh, has a few differences. It has a load of preset settings. The light is red now. Uh, but even the first of the pre preset ones is really good and it does feel a lot better the shifting's a bit faster uh, only two negatives at the moment from, from me one is you got exposed circuitry there behind the like you got the shifter paddle just there and you got the circuit there behind the body and these screws have to go I had a bit of trouble with the um, top screw which is because you got two metal pieces and basically both are threaded so you got a screw that's got to go through two adjoining bits of metal both with pre-done threads so you may have trouble getting over the threshold but at, at the moment it all seems quite good like, it seems a bit quicker to shift down than the standard rim. I do like it and I can't wait for this weekend to give it a proper testing. I might try and find one of my existing F1 lap times, maybe the Austin Power Achievement one, and see if I can beat beat that lap time with the same like car setup. Just try out some different tuning setups on the uh, wheel but it is a lot better feeling and already improves the experience of F1 compared to using the standard CSR Elite which I don't know where to put and I've just left my car to roll into a barrier well thank you for watching I hope you choose to get one of these rims because it is a nice quality bit of kit. Shame that this generation of gaming is coming to an almost to an end. Hopefully they will do a firmware update to make this Xbox One compatible. And I will post a video at this weekend when I do a proper test. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.